Hey guys, it is almost Valentine's Day and today I thought I would show you a hairstyle that you can wear on Valentine's Day that is really cute, really romantic, quite easy to make. In fact, doing this whole thing took me less than 15 minutes altogether and I think it is really beautiful. So this is the hairstyle. We have a little bit of a flower bun going on, some of what I like to call princess curls and uh, yeah. It's just really cute, quite easy to do, so if you want to know how to do this, then definitely keep on watching. I am going to start with a middle part thing from my bangs back, and I am going to start making my braids. So let me get a little bit closer so you can see better. Alright, so to begin, I'm going to take a section of hair from right here, just above my bangs. And I am going to divide this into three sections, and I'm going to start Dutch braiding these. So I'm going to braid under and under and then I'm going to add a little bit of hair to the top section and I'm not going to add any hair to the bottom section so I'm going to make a lace braid by only adding hair to my top section every time I braid and at first I'm just going to braid down along my bangs but then I'm slowly going to turn this towards the back and start braiding to the back of my head and every time I'm just adding a small section of hair to the top section before braiding it alright so when I've reached the center of my head I'm going to stop adding hair and I'm just going to finish this braid all the way down to the ends like a regular braid when I've reached the end, I'm going to tie this off with a little hair elastic. So that's my first braid done. And now I'm going to do the exact same thing on this side as well, so make one more of these braids. Alright, so now I have two braids right here and what I'm going to do next is take each of these and I'm going to fluff them up, which means I'm going to tuck on the sides of my individual braid loops and make them really big and fluffy and flat, just like that. Alright, when both my braids have been fluffed, I'm going to take one of them and I'm going to roll this into a rose or a flower, uh, whatever you will. So I'm just going to start rolling at the tip. And just keep rolling my way up. And then I'm going to just pin this down with a couple of bobby pins. And be sure to pin the inside as well, because that's where the thinnest part of the braid is. Alright, so then I'm going to take the second braid and just wrap that around the first one. And depending on how long your hair is, you'll be able to do this once or twice. Mine only wraps around once. So I'm just going to tuck my end away right underneath here and pin this as well. The rest of my hair I'm going to curl and I'm going to use a tapered curling iron for that. This creates a curl that is looser on the top and tighter on the bottom. Um, the type of curl I like to call princess curls. So that's what I'm going to do. Today I'm going to start by spraying my hair with a little bit of heat protector just so that I don't fry it. I always feel like hairstyles look a little bit more romantic when they're curled. Absolutely feel free to skip this step. This is gorgeous enough in and of its own. Alright, so how I'm going to curl my hair is really simple. I don't want to waste too much time doing this. So I'm just going to take a section from the back here, pull the rest of my hair forward and then I'm going to wrap my hair around the curling iron making sure to keep the white part on the top. I'm going to hold it for a few seconds and just release the curl behind my back. 
I'm going to do that all over my hair and since I've pretty much braided away half of my hair, this should be really quick. So when my curls are done, I'm just going to quickly run my fingers through them. And there is your cute romantic Valentine's Day flower bun hairstyle all done. So I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial guys and I hope you have an amazing Valentine's Day. If you did enjoy this video don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. You can do that by clicking here or the red button below. There is another video here that you may also enjoy. You can go watch next. I want to thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye!